Hey folks, ever wondered how to build your wealth from scratch? Today I'm going to share seven powerful tips that helped me transform my financial approach. From organizing my finances to discovering the positive impact of creating value for others, we'll explore practical paths to financial freedom. Have you thought about working in less exciting jobs initially? Or strategically using debts to increase your wealth? Believe me, the answers go beyond the conventional. Intrigued? Then subscribe to the channel, give it a thumbs up, and join me on this journey to a more prosperous and meaningful financial life. Let's dive in. 5. Financial Organization Create a plan to understand how much you earn and how you spend your money. Having order in your finances is essential to achieve financial goals. You know, the first thing I learned on this journey to financial independence was the importance of organizing finances. It's like tidying up a messy room. If you don't organize it, you won't find anything. So I created a detailed plan to understand exactly how much I earn and how I'm spending my money. Believe me, this organization is the key to achieving any financial goal you have in mind. Now about hard work and earning more, have you ever thought that sometimes we need to start from the bottom? I myself had some jobs that didn't excite me much, but I looked at my empty pocket and took the first step. And guess what? I got promoted in no time. It's amazing how this willingness to work, even in something we don't love initially, can open doors. And if possible, start your own business. It's a challenging journey, but it can be very rewarding. Another thing I realized is the danger of falling for appearances. Sometimes we spend money on things we don't need just to impress others. But look, the truth is that down the line, people who criticize you for your financial choices will be surprised when they see the success you've achieved. Don't fall into that trap. Focus on building your wealth instead of showing off. Finally, I want to share a valuable tip that changed my perspective. Creating value for others. Instead of being obsessed with the idea of making a million dollars, think about how you can help a million people. Successful entrepreneurs like Jeff Bezos and Elon Musk didn't just make money. They offered something valuable to the world. So if you want to change your life, start now. Grab a finance book, invest in yourself, and take the first step. I guarantee that gradually things will fall into place. 4. Hard work and earning more. Work even in less exciting jobs initially. Consider starting your own business to increase income. You know, when I started on this journey, I took on some jobs that honestly didn't excite me at all. But I looked at my empty pocket and thought, it's time to act. Sometimes you have to start from the bottom, even if the job is not your dream. For a while, I wasn't in my dream job either, but every effort counts. The important thing is to take the first step, no matter how small it is. Now, something that made me rethink my path was the idea of starting my own business. It seems challenging, I know, but believe me, it's worth considering. I remember a friend, Fernanda, who, after university, didn't find the ideal job and started as a waitress. She didn't earn much, but that didn't stop her. After a while, she got promoted to cashier, and when she least expected it, she was managing the place. Sometimes the key is to create your own opportunities. The lesson here is that the type of work doesn't matter much in the beginning. If your pocket is empty and the options are not ideal, give it a shot. Even starting something on your own can be the boost you need. Don't worry if it's not perfect from the start. The important thing is to start. It could be the beginning of an incredible journey that you can't even imagine now. So, if you're feeling stuck in a job that doesn't excite you, remember that it's a temporary step towards your financial goals. The journey may be challenging, but with effort and the right mindset, you can achieve amazing things. I believe in you. 3. Avoid falling for appearances. Avoid spending money unnecessarily to impress others. Focus on accumulating wealth instead of displaying status. You know, a valuable lesson I learned is not to fall into the trap of spending money just to impress others. I've been through that, thinking that having expensive things or a flashy lifestyle was the right path. But the reality is that it only leaves you with less money in your pocket every month. It's like we're competing for an image, and in the end, your bank balance loses. I understood that accumulating wealth is much more powerful than showing off status. For a while, I worried about looking successful, buying things I didn't need just to impress. But the truth is, the people who really matter aren't interested in what you own. They're more concerned with who you are and how you contribute to the world. So I shifted my focus to building my wealth instead of showing off to others. Remember, true wealth is not what you display, but what you accumulate over time. 
It might be tempting to spend on flashy things, but that often prevents us from saving and investing. And guess what? Investing is what really makes your money grow. So forget appearances, focus on building a solid and lasting financial future. I made this change, and the results were incredible. You can too! 2. Strategic use of debts. Understand that some debts can be useful to increase wealth. Use debts carefully and manage them properly. It may sound a bit contradictory, but I found out that not all debts are bad, believe it or not. On my journey to financial stability, I learned that some debts can be useful to boost wealth building. It's like a strategic game. If you know how to use the right cards, you can win. The point is not to be afraid of taking on debts, but to learn to use them wisely. I had my moment of initial panic, but then I realized that, if managed correctly, debts can be allies. I know a guy named Matteo, for example, who had an online shoe-selling business. To meet demand, he took a loan from the bank to buy more inventory. The result? He made more money, paid off the debt, and kept growing. Of course, it's not a license to take on debts without thinking. Caution and a solid plan are needed. Just like in a chess game, every move counts. So don't be afraid to use this financial tool to your advantage. If well-managed, it can be a springboard to financial success. I know it worked for me, and it can work for you too. 1. Create value for others. Focus on offering something useful to many people. The key to financial success is adding value and receiving money in return. You know, I discovered that the real magic for financial success lies in offering something amazing to many people. Initially, I just thought about making money, but soon I realized that the secret was in creating value for others. It's like you're building a bridge between what you have to offer and the needs of the people around you. The key, my friend, is not just making money, but adding genuine value. Think about it. Jeff Bezos created Amazon because he wanted to make people's lives easier, and look where he got. And Elon Musk? He founded PayPal to simplify online payments. Both not only made money, but changed the way we live. So the lesson is clear. When you dedicate yourself to making others' lives better, money is a natural consequence. It may sound cliche, I know, but it's true. It can be as simple as solving a common problem innovatively. When you focus on helping, financial rewards come naturally. It's not just about making money. It's about building a legacy. If you find a way to make a difference, you'll not only enrich your life, but also the lives of many others. After all, true success is measured by the positive impact we leave behind. And there you have it, folks. We've reached the end of this discussion on building wealth and achieving financial freedom. I hope these practical tips have inspired you, just as they inspired me. If you enjoyed the content and want more insights like these, don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Oh, and a like would be great to show your support. I also want to know what you think of these strategies. Share in the comments which tip resonated with you the most, or if you have any personal experiences to share. Together, we can create a community committed to achieving financial success intelligently and consciously. Let's grow together! Until next time, and remember, change starts with a simple step.